congratulations, it's a boy. Or congratulations, it's a girl. As a pediatrician for nearly 20 years, that's how many of my patient relationships began. Her bodies to clear our sex. Biological sex is not assigned. Sex is determined at conception by our DNA, stamped into every cell of our bodies. Human sexuality is binary. Either you have a normal Y chromosome and develop into a male, or you don't, and you will develop into a female. There are at least 6,500 genetic differences between men and women. Hormones and surgery cannot and do not change this. Look, an identity is not biological, it is psychological. Identity has to do with thinking and feeling. Thoughts and feelings are not biologically hardwired. Our thinking and feeling may be factually right or factually wrong. For example, if I walk into my doctor's office today and say, hi, I'm Margaret Thatcher, my physician will say I am delusional and give me an antipsychotic. However, if instead I walked in and said, I am a man, he would say, Congratulations, you're transgender. If I were to say, doctor, I am suicidal. I'm an amputee trapped in a normal body. Please, surgically remove my leg. I'll be diagnosed with body identity integrity disorder. But if I walk up to that same doctor and say, I'm a man, sign me up for a double mastectomy, my physician will. See, according to most mainstream medical organizations, if you want to cut off a healthy arm or a healthy leg, you're mentally ill. But if you want to cut off healthy breasts or a penis, you're transgender. Let's be clear, no one is born transgender.